Hello there, Christian. All right, excellent work. Let's keep moving. Leading so ah, by the way, as well, good work with planning. That's an, a very, very important task, and it's good to see you working through the methodology and putting your notes down there in shorthand. Brief um, is just a good, solid way to organize your thoughts. So keep doing that. Well done. Let me just check the word count here because that introduction possibly could be a little bit longer than necessary. Oops. Okay, 246, that's fine. However, if possible, it's usually better to have beefier or better, longer body paragraphs rather than longer introductions. And the reason is because the bulk of the points are picked up in your body paragraphs. So let's go. Leading software and hardware developers think. So we need to add that to your error list. Okay, singular plural agreement. Think that technology, think that technology, I wouldn't put it in there unless it's absolutely necessary, yeah? Leading software and hardware developers think that technology should be created to integrate into people's life. Yet. Okay, so here is the punctuation before a coordinating conjunction. Okay, integrate into people's life. Yet, it can be observed in our society day by day, day, day by day, that humans tend to become slaves of it. Okay, we could also say tend to become enslaved by it. It's just another way of saying it. Um, okay, so I can see here, right, we've got a lot of commas. Um, there is some software out there, Grammarly, which is terrible because it just puts so commas in everywhere. And it's really choppy to read. Um, I would just put them in when they're necessary. And that just helps flow in. The, the flow. I believe technology is a potential type to human intelligence, so individuals should consider how much of it they let enter to the, into let enter their lives would be better. In this essay, I will use examples from the Traffic Department of Canada and Apple Corporation. Good to demonstrate and describe the argument. Good. Well done for remembering Apple Corporation as well. Also. We can depersonalize this. This essay will, okay, and we've saved ourselves three or four words. This essay will use examples in order to demonstrate and describe the argument. Fine. Okay. Now, what I was saying before about shortening that introduction. Let's see. Let's get into people's lives. Okay. So it's valid. And it can be says, there we go. That's valid. Yeah. And then we might be under the word count, in which case we can add a furthermore, yeah? Furthermore, and then give another point, and then delve into that point, expand that point with supporting sentences, specifically with an example, okay? So maybe we give two points, then on the second point, we go into more detail with an example. That just makes your paragraph a little bit stronger, your argument stronger, um, and also more opportunity to get points for vocabulary. Um, plus, that bodes well uh, with the general consensus of points I gained in the paragraphs, the body paragraphs. So let's go. Nowadays, many sociologists, good, are concerned about people becoming slaves of technology. Good. Okay. So we've got the same term a few times now. What could we say? We enslave, like I said before, are becoming um, servants of technology, are becoming, uh, or technology becoming master of people. You know, there's a few different ways. So let's see, it can be observed that more and more people are checking their smartphones constantly looking for recent up updates on Facebook. Good. Recent report from the Traffic Department of Canada shows that 8% of traffic accidents are occurred because of drivers using social media apps. Meanwhile, while driving is fine. Okay, meanwhile is a slightly different meaning. While driving. Thus, technological dependency can be physically and mentally dangerous, especially for people with addictive habits. Genius. 
good solid argument crystal clear wonderful work there christian in addition in addition artificial intelligence and other widely spread productivity software are getting more and more are becoming more are becoming ever more popular that sounds much better are becoming ever more popular amongst early technology adopters good as an example apple's siri is analyzing its users behavior and it provides suggestions to solve problems causing less stimulation for intelligent thinking good to conclude it is commonly believed that technology invades people's private and professional lives and endangers creative thinking developed by evolution good very good very good so what a dish let's see would have been good if we could have linked this a little bit more to intelligence yeah because it looks like it's in dangerous creative thinking um but we could have said in in dangerous intellect creative thinking um and something else yeah just to bring it back to task response and remind the examiner that we are going to get full response full points for task response all right christian so good work there great start um great paragraph sorry let's see there's something else i wanted to mention anyway to conclude the limitless spread of technology good sentence is a potential danger for humankind but the current generation has the power to avoid anti-evolutionary development by building new technologies responsibly good how about anything about intellect here yeah just reminding the examiner bringing it back okay you want to make the examiner's life easy and we do this by writing strong coherent paragraphs that you've done that are on task response that hit the nail on the head so to speak which you have done okay but we also need to remind the examiner make their life easier by constantly reminding them that we are on task response and this is a solid essay that pays attention to the question asked which is what we're doing but there's no harm in a little reminder okay so good work there christians the recruitment team okay writing to apply for the software developer position develop position you advertised in linkedin solid start solid introduction good remember there's a space here also this is fine okay however um i don't know if it's standard letter protocol but what i do know is that this is definitely standard protocol yeah dear sir madam so what you're doing is valid but i don't know how the examiners would react but i do know that the examiners would react positively to this okay oops daisy sorry about that so let's carry on right into the plate yep i'm a bachelor in informa informatics doesn't exist Inform information technology or just it information technology specialized in specialized in sap software development good in the last two decades i worked as a software engineer for multiple international corporations and i gained experience in different industrial fields genius good vocabulary twist it to your advantage so i i guess you work in it anyway i've been the client of your your company for several years and i'm very impressed with the brand and the product quality of your firm genius very excited to have a chance to be part of your organization good I would enjoy to have, I would enjoy to have, enjoy having, okay, enjoy to have the opportunity, uh, enjoy to have, I, think, I would enjoy having the opportunity, uh, let me think of a better way to say this, I would delight in the opportunity, sounds a little bit better, okay, I would enjoy to have, is valid but i would be delighted in having the opportunity i would delight in the opportunity yep it's just a little bit stronger uh delight is slightly less common than enjoy so it's an, an improvement we're showing we've got more sophisticated vocabulary i would be delighted to have yes now we're talking i would be delighted yeah we're using a different structure that we probably haven't used before so I would be delighted to have the opportunity to talk with you to, defer, to discuss further the requirements and expectations of this position and how I could use my skills to benefit your company. Fantastic. Thank you for considering my application. Yours sincerely.
Okay, small improvement, right? Um, standard copy paste sentences for letter writing, which would be in this case, um, please find attached my CV and do not hesitate to, and please do not, and please do not hesitate to contact me regarding any in, uh, regarding any questions. Comma. Furthermore, I'm available between the hours of nine till five, Tuesdays and Thursdays. Full stop. Yep, just standard letter writing phrases, especially for task one. Also, regarding new structures that we can say, well, we can say, um, let's see. It is predicted that in the future, technology will slowly become more available to and more beneficial to people, especially those working in IT or something like that. But just a small sentence about the future. It is predicted that or in the future, um, it is forecasted. Yeah. So we're just using another tense that we haven't used before. All right. So good work there. Let's, uh, let's see, we've got two inch. Ah, okay, to conclude, to conclude, let's just use therefore, yeah? Have we used therefore here? No. So repetition, be careful. Excellent work, Christian. Uh, I haven't forgot that you've got a speaking class. Um, have a look on Calendly and book it, and also send me an email if you could as well, just to remind me. And also, if you feel necessary, if you feel it necessary, send me a WhatsApp as well. All right, then we're on the same page. Uh, I missed your last lesson because it was just New Year traveling around a bit or a bit chaotic. Num my number is plus three four. That's plus three four six seven zero oh, eight zero six zero five one. Okay, and. Uh, yeah, send me a WhatsApp once you've booked that class. All right, buddy, have a good day. And you know what to do now. Implement all the corrections, send me about the corrected essay, write me two new essays and check those for mistakes you made previously. Update that error list as well. Good work, bud.